Hello, Mark. So I don't know if y'all seen it, but Iran is talking junk. They mad because we took a missile and teabagged their leading general with it. There's a good possibility that we could be going to World War III, which means people could get drafted. So right now, I'm going to do this training video here to show y'all what you need to do to get ready just in case you get drafted. Now, I know you're probably wondering, well, is this fella here a Delta Force or is he a Navy SEAL? No, I am none of the above, but I'm really good at playing Call of Duty and Modern Warfare and Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Now, the first thing you need to work on is agility. You need to be as agile as a mongoose to be able to fight. Your agility is very important. You can't be stiff as a board. You got to be able to move. Because you don't know when you'll be jumping in out of trenches, climbing over trees. Ain't no telling what you're going to be doing on the battlefield. So you got to prepare yourself. All right, that's it for your agility training. Now we'll be training in camouflage. Camouflage is very important. You have to blend in with your surroundings. If you become one with the environment, the enemy will never see you. Didn't have a clue I was there, did you? You see, I'm like a cobra. I strike so fast, you don't even know what happened until you're dead. All right, so the next thing I'm gonna train you in is hand-to-hand -hand combat because you never know when you might run out of bullets and you're gonna have to fight the enemy hand to hand. All right, so now I will be training you in hand to hand combat. This is my wife. She will be portraying an enemy soldier. First thing I'm gonna show you is how to defend yourself from an enemy soldier putting you in a rear naked choke. All right, we're gonna pretend that I'm sitting here and I'm watching, I'm looking for the enemy. But all of a sudden, the enemy soldier has me in a rear naked choke. Now. I'm going to show you how to get out. Listen. Oh, all right, she's getting, getting tight. Getting tight. <coughs> all right. All right, so let's just say that that was to show you how not to do it. All right, so now I'm going to show you how to get the enemy soldier in a rear naked choke. The enemy soldier is looking away. They do not know I'm coming. I'm sneaking upon them silently. And this is when I grab them like this. All right, that's enough for the hand-to-hand -hand training. We're just gonna go straight to weapons training now. All right, so the first thing you wanna always remember about your weapon is that your weapon is your friend, all right? Without your friend, you may die. And the main part about your gun is the bullets because without the bullets this is just a really expensive rock that you got to beat somebody with okay you got to have the bullets you got to have it properly loaded you got to make sure she's good and lubricated all right you got to treat her good if you want her to treat you good and take care of you now so the first thing you need to do to work on your reflexes and make sure you're quick at drawing that gun up and hitting that enemy soldier before they hit you is taking your gun and going left straight Right, straight, left, straight, right. That's the first thing you need to do, right? It gets you real quick, get your eyes adjusted. So that way, you quick on the draw, you can kill the enemy. Now I'm gonna show you how to sight in your rifle. The enemy soldier will be played by a cardboard cutout of Megatron. Now, as you can see, I'm using a Nerf gun because this is a training session and because Facebook won't monetize my video if I got a real gun. Right in the chest, that's where you want to go. You know, pop them in the chest and pop them in the noggin. That way you know that they good and dead. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is our weapons training. So as you can tell, I am very well trained and I know what I'm doing. So if you follow these instructions on this video, I can guarantee you will be a killing machine by the time you do it. God bless y'all.